Hi, I am Daniel, and I'm working as a health coach for conditions such as long COVID, chronic fatigue syndrome, fibromyalgia, adrenal fatigue, chronic pain, and anxiety, for example. And in ME-CFS or chronic fatigue syndrome, you experience the lack of energy. And studies have been shown that the mitochondria of people with these conditions are not working properly. So then the idea is that we should fix it, help it, improve it, etc. The mitochondria are sort of the powerhouses of the cell, and they produce the energy and the ATP. So should you take supplements, for example, uh, coenzymes or ATP, to improve the energy of the cell? Well, I've done this many years ago when that study was just being published, and I took all the supplements, and it was very expensive. And the idea is if you just take it long enough, then maybe you find out that it works. But for me, this didn't work at all. Maybe there was a short moment of placebo, but in the long run, I was like, this doesn't work for me. We know now that the brain is using the mitochondria to produce symptoms as a protection mechanism. So for example, uh, pain and fatigue are bro both protection mechanisms to avoid you from going further and either exhausting yourself or hurting yourself more. And as soon as your brain detects a danger, it can turn the symptom on, just like that. And as a consequence, you immediately have the symptom of the mitochondria and having no energy. We can also turn this response off. If we remove the stressor that the brain perceives as a danger, the protection mechanism is no longer needed. And as a consequence, the symptom is gone. And you will experience again an increase in energy. And even funnier, we can play with the stressors and the symptoms, and we can turn them on, off, on, off, on, off, to really show you the underlying mechanism of what is going on. If you like the content, then please subscribe to it, give it a like, and that will really help us spreading this message. So if we can turn this on and off on the month, it means that there is nothing wrong with the mitochondria. And that's a relief because there are many mitochondria and fixing it is very expensive. So fortunately for me and for you and for everyone else, there is nothing inherently wrong with the mitochondria. And giving it, giving it supplements like ATP also doesn't make any sense because the brain is choosing at the moment to have less energy. So whatever you, you consume, it doesn't make any sense. It, it, it won't do anything. And with the work that we're doing, we're preparing you to have a release. And that can take a while, depending on the stress levels and, and, and the stress that is inside of you. And after that, we go in, we find it in the body, we feel it, and we can release it. And then after that, the symptoms just improve or vanish completely. And the greatest thing about this release process is that you're not really needing anything. So you don't need supplements. You don't need any products. All you need is yourself, some time and some willingness to go in. So luckily I and many other people have recovered without any supplements, but I did spend a lot of money on supplements. And maybe you as well. Could you tell us how much you have spent on your supplements in the comments? And yeah, be honest and don't get scared of the truth. If you'd like to find out more, then visit our website, releasecfs.com. And there's a lot of free information there, but there is also a paid online course. And thank you for, for watching.